All right, here we have question D. We know that PQRS is a parallelogram. What do we know about these things? Well, these are the um, diagonals. And then we know for a parallelogram, the diagonals bisect. So diagonals bisect. So that means their parts are congruent. Therefore, we can say 2x is equal to 10, divide by 2, divide by 2, x is equal to 5. Next, this is a rhombus. Did you know all the sides for a rhombus are congruent? That means 3x is equal to x plus 2 minus x to both sides. This, uh, this becomes 2x is equal, this cancels, equals to 2. Divide 2 to both sides, 2 over 2 cancels, x is equal to 1. Then the last one, rectangle, uh, the length here is congruent to the length here. So we can say... 8x minus 13 is equal to 7x plus 11 minus 7x to both sides because we're trying to get x alone. This cancels, leaving you with just an x. Minus 13 is equal to 11 plus 13 to both sides. This does cancel, leaving you with x is equal to 24. So the, there you go. That is how we solve for the variables in every one of these shapes.